Ia ka na abudu e ia ka na stain. Mere UK ke gayur Pakistaniyo. I wish I was physically standing in today's protest with all of you. But even after 15 months and 4 days, for 55 days of my unjust imprisonment, I am still on the ECL, watchless, topless, no fly list and blah blah blah. I am still facing multiple house raids, detention orders, uncountable FIRs and cases in almost all the terrorism courts of Punjab, Islamabad, and even a recent one in Quetta, Balochistan. You might have seen superheroes in movies, but I am the real deal. A superwoman who's been to Lahore, Gujranwala, Faisalabad, Miawali, Sargodha, Rawalpindi, Islamabad, and Quetta in all in one day. As per the FIRs made on me, firstly, thank you everyone for joining our protest, joining our cause today. Not that I had any doubt, but we PTI truly have the superb social media warriors, excellent ground workers, and above all, the best overseas Pakistanis. You guys live abroad, away from your own soil, own country. But your heart still beats for Pakistan, for us Pakistanis, especially those suffering. You celebrate Pakistan's victories and cry when any bad thing happens to Pakistan. You all are true patriots. I salute you all for standing for us, using every resource to raise your voice against the fascism and oppression against us PTI. Whether it's approaching U.S. congressmen, IPU, UN Working Group, or Amnesty International, or any human rights organization, you are heroes, real heroes, who kept PTI alive when every effort was done to crush our own PTI. Our houses were demolished, our families were harassed, our electoral symbol were taken. Our candidates were harassed. Our papers were rejected. But you guys kept on fighting when there was a complete media blackout on PTI, and the media was not allowed to show our pictures, videos, and news related to us. You raised your voice for us. Even now, they are not allowed to take PM Aikesar's name or to show his picture on TV. What's this all, Bani PTI? He is Imran Ahmed Khan Niazi, Prime Minister of Pakistan. Mera wo kaid jo goliya khakar bhi muskuraya, mukka lehra kar awam ko hosla diya. Pakistan se mohabbat karne wala, jisne hamesha apni zat par apne mulk ko kaum ko tarjeeh di. But you all did wonders on social media, from raising your voices. To running election campaigns for multiple electoral symbols, including my symbol dies. You are the reason why I defeated Hamza Shehbaz while sitting in jail. You are the reason. That's why we won that battle. Alhamdulillah. Even your own families, your relatives faced the worst pressures and tortures in Pakistan. But you all proved your strength as the real soldiers of Prime Minister Imran Khan. Recent example is the threat of your Pakistani passport being cancelled, but all of you stood firm and came to this protest. This battle is not yet over. In fact, we have entered the final phase of our struggle now. यानी final call पहुंच चुकी है. मतलब रुकना नहीं है, झुकना नहीं है. Because it's a matter of real son of soil, the hope of Pakistan. He is unlawfully detained, isolated, and tortured since 5th August 2024, confined in a gutter cage where rats and insects can freely roam. They are treating him worse than real criminals. It's a cruelty at its peak. Treating a former prime minister this way and the leader of 25 crore awam. They have deprived him of his basic rights: no family meeting for 23 days, no lawyer access, no electricity, no hygienic food, no newspaper, TV, books, no TV, no books, no exercise, no case hearing. Even jail trials were suspended during these 23 days. इससे बढ़के जुन किसको कहते हैं? दिल खून के आंसू रोता है. 
His wife stayed in jail for nine months. His sisters were put in jail and are facing multiple anti-terrorism cases. His nephew is still in military courts with 88 more other prisoners. Wazir Azam Khan ke khandan ne is mulk mein jo kurbaniyon ki nai misal kaim ki hai. Salam hai Shaukat Khanam ke is khandan ko. Despite court orders, PM Aika was not allowed to meet his lawyers, his party leadership. All his communication is blocked. All efforts are done to silence his voice. Saw saal jail mein guzarne pade guzarunga. Lekin kaum ki izzat ki saudebazi nahi karunga. Mera sawaal, kya hum apne leader ko saw din tak jail mein rehne denge? Jawaab, a big no. After passing 455 days in solitary confinement, enduring harshest condition, or PM Imran Khan is still firmly standing for his nation, his people, for Hakiki Azadi. His message for all of us is they want to break me through this torture, through this hardship, but I stand firm for the genuine freedom of. My nation, my Pakistani nation. Ek baat yaad rakhiye ka. Khan ko hamari nahi. Hame Khan ki zarurat hai. Main aur aap Khan ke liye nahi. Apni aindha aane wali naslon ke liye kurbani de rahe hain. Ehsan to Khan ka Pakistan aur Pakistaniyo par hai. Main aur aap to bas apne hisse ka diya jala rahe hain. This demonstration aimed to raise international awareness and call for immediate 